Welcome back. Random TV Reviews, your girl Lynette. Your boy, Stanley. Listen, if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're an old family member, you coming back for the rest of the Empire, welcome back. Yes, indeed. We on a new season, y'all. Yeah, if you're new to the channel, we do things a little different over here. We don't do no drama, all that. We go through it. Sometimes we go through some rabbit holes. But we're going to give you what the episode gave us. And if it ain't giving us skit, we're going to tell y'all it ain't giving us skit. But we're just going to get right into it. Because this right here, I was not expecting. Nah, I wasn't ready. They threw a curveball at me for sure this season. Yeah, so we start off and basically they're trying to prepare themselves for the 20th anniversary of the Empire. So we see them going through the motions of talking about Lucius and how, you know, of course in Vegas, Andre set him up to get blowed away. Mm -hmm. Tried to call it off at the last minute, but it didn't work. Now I'm trying to figure out like, okay, when are they going to show us Lucius and let us know what his real condition is? Okay, we're going to get to it. We're going to get to it. So we see Cookie going through her little interviews phase, and she's talking about, you know, how much Lucius meant to her, how much he meant to the company, and how she's running the company in his absence, solo dolo, until he gets back, you know, back into the empire. You know, Andre is giving his little spill on the same thing. And I said, Andre, don't say too much. Don't say too much, especially if your meds are not calibrated. Stop talking. And Andre, but his, his meds must be calibrated because he stopped himself. Yeah, he said, go ahead and cut that off right there. And, and don't, don't put it on record. Yeah, don't put that on record. <laughs> <laughs> so there was another scene right you know, before we even get to Lucius coming home, right? We see, what's his name? Um, Warren. Warren is the son of Mrs. Dubois. Mm -hmm. And we knew last time this went off that Warren and his family was up to something. Well, come find out. First of all, I'm so sick and tired of Jamal being the hoe. Yeah. Of this God doing show. I'm just so sick of it. How he, he want to love too God doing easy. Where the little dude that they used to cook? We Him gone. Yeah, that's the that's the kind of people people don't want. <laughs> the ones that got a yeah. real the ones that can give you a real life, real reality to take care of, you know, you don't want them ones. You want ones that dog you out. So yeah, so Jamal is now sleeping with Warren. Now, Warren is acting like he's all into Jamal, but come find out. Warren goes back to report to his mama. Now, this freaked me out a little bit because oh, Miss Dubois weird. is getting a massage by her masseuse, but her son is standing there talking to her while all this right here is exposed. Yeah, and her, and her titty, titty, her titty, 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 titty right here was showing a little bit too. For real? No. That's your mama, dog. Yeah, that's your mama. And I'm I'll be like, mama, I talked to you after your naked massage. That's your son, dog. So he was basically like, listen, I can't, I can't crack this nut right here because what he got going on with his father will not allow me to get any further into his mind that I've already done. I'm sorry, mama, but this is gonna take I, I a can't little do. longer. Yeah. Than I expected it to take. She said, listen here. Cookie Line don't came in my family and don't wreck havoc. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to destroy every last one of her kids' lives. One by one. And I'm going to pick the meat off the bone. But you, 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 see, see, let's, let's travel in this room real quick. couple seconds. Let's go. You going in revenge against Cookie's kids when your son was the one that got what got done on um, Cookie Line. You tried to warn him, but he didn't want to listen. So it was ultimately his decision that got his life destroyed. Now, why are you trying to kick in to destroy her kids when her kids ain't got nothing to do with what your kid did when you told him not to do it? But the bad thing about it is, Cookie ain't even had nothing to really do with that. It is no. all Lucius. Yeah, yeah. It's all Lucius being, being the cop blocker that he is. He can go out there and da 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 and everything around. And put on the blue it because his mic was still on. He started running his mouth. So he kind of did to himself. Kinda. You know, you should have checked the mic to make sure the mic was off before you started <laughs> running your mouth. And then while we on Miss Dubois, remember we saw Hakeem go over there and talk to Miss Dubois and we never figured out what the heck was going on. Yeah, but all we was. know now is Hakeem has his daughter back. But Miss Dubois shows her hard parts up over at um Hakeem's house talking about some um you missed our visitation. He was like, listen, for the last five months, I've been bringing her to you every Tuesday. Every Tuesday. I just happened to have a day where I couldn't bring her to you. Matter of fact, this deal is off. She said, oh, no, no, no. You may not want that to happen. Because look look at these pictures right here. 
See right there, this is this is betrayal. What would your mama say uh -huh. if she knew that you were consulting with the enemy? Yeah, you signed a deal with the devil. And he said, well, speaking of a deal, what did I sign? Because you still ain't told me what you want. All you did was gave me my daughter, say you won't see her every Tuesday. And that don't make much sense to me. Nah. And it don't make sense to me either. What you want? Yeah. Well, she, we already know. We already know uh -huh. what she wants. But she said until further notice, you just keep on bringing that baby around here at Tuesday. And I uh -huh. said, I said, you know what? They ain't half bad idea, though. They ain't half bad deal. You get a babysitter every Tuesday. Mm -hmm. You ain't got every to bring Tuesday. no milk, syrup. But no see, girl you don't trust snacks. them, see, though. But she ain't gonna hurt the baby. Yeah. yeah. But how can you trust somebody to stole your baby? I don't, yeah, care how I, I don't care how nice he is or they give him back to you. I still don't trust you because you stole him. <laughs> so somebody stole your car. Think about it. They stole your car. Then they gave your car back to you. But the deal is you got to let them drive it every Saturday. Stop. Stop. Shut up. <laughs> So now all of a sudden you're going to trust them because they gave you the car back. Like, well, they gave you the car back, you know. Yeah, I'm, I'll let them go on job. Hell no. <laughs> so this the part. This the part right here. I wasn't ready for it, and I know none of y'all were ready for it either. We over there at the mansion. Over there at um, Lucia's estate. And all the family has gathered together. And this is the time where they say that Mr. Lucia's line and Claudia are on a plane and they on their way home. Yeah. And they said, you know, cause he, they promised everybody that he was gonna make an appearance at the 20th anniversary celebration. Mm -hmm. So he coming on home, he coming out the hospital, come out of rehab, whatever, cause they ain't show us none of that. Um, they pull up, everybody standing out there, had a little color purple um, episode, little scene going on. And the next thing we know, we see two crutches hit right. the ground, and all of a sudden, I saw one leg planted on the ground, and, and another one, one just never made it. Yeah. <laughs> and I said, "Wait what, a god! What kind of bullshit is this? Y'all took, y'all took, <coughs> y'all took Lucia's leg, though. So the rest of the history of Empire, Lucia's ain't gonna have no goddamn leg. Just think about that for a minute. For the rest." Of empire history. Unless he bullshit. <laughs> How you bullshit and not have a leg? He ain't got no goddamn legs that. Think about it. <laughs> Think about the people that you know. They make up bullshit excuses in order to, to get over on the system. That's back problems. They they do back problem. They do neck injuries. They ain't never lost no whole goddamn leg. Nah, they ain't never pulled that yet. <laughs> but if they could, they would. <laughs> they walk in the doctor's office, fold their leg back with they throw the leg back and be like, Doc, I need you to take me out of work for six months because I ain't got no leg. The doctor be like, oh, sir, your leg is tucked up behind you. Get out of here with that boost. Get. And then they gonna be like, oh, it is? Oh, I oh, my bad. Oh, it must be that medicine that you put me on. How much can I get for that? A month. So everybody's looking at the daddy like, man, it just don't got real right, right. here. Now here come Lucius. Why is everybody looking so sad? He talking about electricity. Yeah. Energy, electrodes. He like this. <laughs> he like this Einstein now. He just know everything and real smart, talking real proper. It's like, and don't remember nobody. Nobody. So they get him into the house. Now, Cookie's job is to try to force Lucius into remembering stuff that he don't remember because it, it's. The cognitive is gone. Yep. It's just gone. Your mama nothing. Unless he playing. And I got some questions about that too. But, but, you, me... but you know what? He, he he very well could be playing. Cause remember he was playing when he was in that in that bed in the house? Acting like he was so all messed up and <laughs> He would die from ALS. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean yeah. he was, but he was just misdiagnosed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he played a trick on him though. Uh-huh. So he of course Okay, um, Cookie started letting Lucius hear some of his music and stuff. Lucius said, why is all my lyrics so, so violent? violent? Why am I so angry? I don't remember writing any of Every that. time I listen to it, it hurts my head. <laughs> Get a migraine. Why? What the? I said. So then we look. Cookie said, you know what? Let me go ahead and get the photo out. Maybe that'll jog his memory a little bit too much. I'm um, a little bit too. Get the photo album. He looking through the pictures. 
And he was like, I've noticed that every <laughs> picture in there, you're missing Cookie. What's going on? Was you taking the picture? She said, I, I explained to you there was a moment of time where we had a great separation of time where we weren't together. Well, why is that? And how long was it? Now, Claudia over in the cut looking at them like, mm, -mm too heavy. Not, let's not talk about this. So, they kind of having a tiptoe around these major and heavy situations and these conversations because they don't want him to go backwards. They want him to move forward like the song say, I'm moving forward. <laughs> but they don't want him to go backwards because you're just going to drop all that load on him and tell him how much of a bullscatter he was mm -hmm. and how much he bucked up the family. <laughs> and none of them don't want to have no sympathy on him. No. All the... No. All the booze he done took them through too? So, you know, she, she told him, said, no, you know, there was just a moment of time where we just weren't together no more. And he keeps talking about myself, but why? And I'm well, sitting there like. Yep. <laughs> took like a little kid. And he Please said, tell me. She, he said, well, how long? She said, 17 years. He said, oh, that's a long time. I said, Lucius, just leave it alone. Leave it alone. Just leave it the heck alone. So, they keep going on around this, round and round, round and round. But let me go ahead and get on Claudia's hind parts right now. Yep, yep, yep. I don't, I don't trust her. her. I don't trust her. I don't, I don't trust, trust her. her. And I, I don't, don't trust her. And this is my theory right here, right now. I don't know how much, how true it is. I ain't giving it a lot of thought. But I thought about it as soon as I started watching this. Has she been paid by the Dubois to freaking program him? Hmm. Because some may write. Because this this ninja is in the sunken place. He in the sunken. Somebody place. need to take the picture right away and get him up out of there. Unless both of them running game on us. And when Cookie was in that guy doing um kitchen and she had that tea gla tea cup, I was like, keep turning it, ding a ling a ling a ling a ling, keep turning it because he might come out the sunken place if you hit it long enough. Because he came in the kitchen, he's still talking to Cookie, and he's asking Cookie. He was like, you know. Did someone do this to me? Because I don't remember anything, Dang. but you seem like a nice person. What happened? Yeah. Am I that bad of a person that somebody would do this to me? And she said, no, what happened was you saved my life. And I said, Cookie, tell me the truth. Yeah, tell me That's truth. just me being mean. Tell me y'all ninja tried to blow him up. You and Andre tried to blow him up. So y'all get the empire. Yeah. And then y'all change your mind. And then he ended up saving you. And now he ain't got no leg. Say and, it. It's and my no leg. Brain. It's my leg. I don't know. He might be bullshitting them though. <laughs> I don't know. He might be bullshitting them to see where their mind is and what their next move is. Cause you know, he, you know, Lucius is always like 10 steps ahead of them. Even when they tried to buck up the stuff in LA. He was like 10 steps ahead where, of them. Oh, Vegas. In Vegas, yeah. He was 10 steps ahead of them to stop that bullshit. Huh? Except for the bomb. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He, unless he knew about it. Nah, nah, he ain't know nothing about that. So then we had the scene where all of them are deciding to go out there outside and have a dinner, kind of like the Housewives of Atlanta before oh, all the bull skit happens. Oh, I said, did y'all y'all having a freaking um, <laughs> Real Housewives of Atlanta <laughs> dinner scene right here? You know it's about to go all bad when everybody's at the long uh -huh. table together. And everybody's acting real calm and real nice. I said, it's about ready to go to hell so real Lucius, fast. He leaning on his cane, Thompson. <laughs> he said, cookie. I like her. She is she always like this. They's like, <laughs> yeah, she's always like that. Said, Hi King. You got baby Bella and Tiana. Cause he thinks Tiana is Bella's mama. Yeah. <laughs> He's on my son. I like what you got going on there. Andre. Well, who do you have? I said, oh um, no, no, no. Andre got went into that look. Andre said. I uh, had a I wife. had a wife. Well, what happened? She died. That's a long story. He said, well, when? He said, a long, long, long time ago. A long time ago. Drink that. And I said, oh, hell, he about to go to Jamal. Uh -huh, yep. He said, Jamal. Now, this is the part right here that made me think, Lucius is in there. Uh. He said, Jamal, where's your friend at? Why doesn't he come around? Jamal, Jamal said. How you know it's a he? He said, oh, oh I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Did I offend you? you? It's not a he. He said, yeah, it is a he. <laughs> and Jamal was like, you know what? I'm just kind of take things slow. One step at a time, sweet Jesus, that's all he's asking of me. He said, but why? 
love. 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 love is love. You just need to go ahead and move for. Is it because of me? <laughs> Yeah, when he did that, I was like, Lucius, is he giving himself away? Lucius is in there. <laughs> Lucius is coming through. Lucius in there. He's just around the corner. Just around the corner. He's, yeah, he, he hasn't broke the corner yet. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he in the back of Thirsty car and Thirsty is in the front. Thirsty don't made the corner, but Lucius ain't came around the corner yet. Lucius get ready to come around the corner. So next thing we know, Hakeem ain't had enough of this. He had had enough of the tiptoeing and the song and dance. Yeah. He said, why can't we be freaking artists around here, this family? Yeah. We all are jacked up. Yeah. And it's mostly because of him right there. Yep. So let's just go ahead and put it all on the table. And Andre said, you fool. Didn't we sit yeah. here and tell you this is too heavy for dad to handle <laughs> right now. You're going to make him flip. And they argue. Everybody got into a big old argument. The next thing we know... Lucius turned into Andre while Andre was in that boardroom with that guy yeah. doing basketball. Yeah. He took the pitcher of ice, water, iced tea, or whatever it is, and that went flying. Tell her how to shut up! <laughs> that motherfucker got on them guy doing okay. them crutches, boy, and went across that yard. He was he like, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. I'm gone. I thought he was headed to get in the car. No, this nigga's headed to go to the water. <laughs> He said, I'm sick of this life. I'm sick of it. Y'all trying to make me into somebody that I'm not. I'm not that person. I don't remember. He said, the music's breaking my hair. Y'all are crazy. <laughs> How you want me to be myself when y'all don't even love yourselves? Uh -huh. so, y'all both beat my family. I said. <laughs> now, we got Claudia in the background looking like. And every time she look at him, it's kind of like giving him this reassurance that they together or some mess like this. Yeah. I said, something about her is not sitting well, see, I I, 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 I like Denny more, but I, I don't like her, this white lady in this part right here. You know all that. They found making all the money. Her, yeah. The daughter's in here. Uh-huh. And they look just alike, too. The yeah, daughter yeah. and the mom in there. They said yeah. they're going to racks on racks on racks. Yeah. So they, they reassure Lucia that they're going to try to be better. And they don't he don't need nobody but the love and the support of his family until he get his skit together. We 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 here. We here. And I'm like, God, don't I? I just was not ready to to face. I was ready to have a few episodes where Lucia didn't know nobody. But I sure wasn't ready for Lucia not to have no leg. Now, see what I was ready for. I was ready for us to show what happened. That yeah. he made it over the bomb. He back at Empire, and he was gonna reverse everything that he told them before he got blowed up. Andre, you can't have a company now. Uh, Cookie, we ain't gonna travel the world. I was just boost getting with all of y'all. He might still do. You don't never know. Yeah. Lucius is something else. But before this even happened, I forgot this part. They had, um, there was a song on the album that was Love Me. Yeah. And <laughs> Lucius said he liked that song. Out of all the music that make his head hurt, he liked this song. And he asked, he was like, I don't remember making this song. And I don't understand why the song was so different than the other songs that made my head hurt. Well... They let her let him know that um Cookie actually wrote that song. You were having writer's block. So she wrote that song when she was in jail, basically. And he said, you know what? But why is that your name on the credits? You should get you should get credit for your work. That's not right, Cookie. That's not right. <laughs> so I said, okay, well, what's what's gonna happen with this? So now we go over there. It's the 20th anniversary of Empire. Lucia showed up as they promised that he would. But he had a straight up Rain Man moment before he even hit the stage. He got yeah, to the he back. He saw people. He saw cameras. He said, oh, no, oh, no, oh, oh no. no, it's happening again. Yep. He flipped out, fell all down on the ground. I said, Lord have mercy. This is not a way to, to come up in there. So Claudia kind of talked them back down. I told him, say, if you, if you think this is too heavy for you, do some deep breathing, and, and we can around. go home. And look around. You know, let's talk about what's real. Yeah. It's like, I said, well, what's, what's real? What's real? Tell me. What's real? Tell me some. Did you KC know, tell you that? You survive. You survive the goddamn explosion. You know, get out the coma. And I'm real. Cookie said, I'm real. But how come Claudia got on Anika's dress? Yeah. Come on, I found her in the closet. 
And then she had on a bracelet that Cookie was <laughs> peeping, but I didn't. I wasn't able to to connect it to nothing. But that's gonna come up too. I said, what, 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 what's going on with? This? Don't trust her. Don't trust Don't her. Don't trust her. Don't trust her. So we got the boys out there. They're performing. They're doing all this. And then they said, you know, I know y'all been waiting for this moment. The Kang is here. <laughs> the Kang is in the building as promised. Lucius Lyon come take the stage. Well, there's this big long pause. It was like, where he at? Wait, what, what? So I'm thinking Lucius went on home. Because Cookie said, if you want to go home, I'll take you home. But he, he come. He come around the corner. And I'm going to say this. Because my mama does this. <laughs> my mama is posh paraplegic. And uh, right. When there's a spotlight, she will perform. Uh-huh. Lucius yep. came around that corner. Now, you was going across that goddamn yard 25 miles per hour. Uh-huh. But you gonna come out there doing 2.5. You had a limp that you uh -huh. didn't have a while ago. Uh-huh. So, um, what's going on, Lucius? See, don't do not do it. Don't do it. <laughs> I black people do. Yeah, we'll black people put 20 on 10 all the time. All the time. For no reason. No reason. Why? Nah, I gonna do it. I do it. Hell. <laughs> I was gonna get you. No, I ain't gonna do it on this one. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. So he finally gets to the microphone. And then I was saying to myself, well, maybe Lucius is back. First of all, he came out there. The damn liar. I was like, wait a minute. Like, all right. Uh oh. So then he said, listen, I went through a traumatic experience i got blowed up and then he proceeds to lift up the, his pants leg and show everybody that his leg is gone he said listen the person that y'all know ain't here no more but with the love and the support of my family and the empire i can oh, make man. it through anything. anything and the king is here just don't never forget it and did y'all see that that 360 degree what actually 180 degree spin that he did i said just because you got one leg don't mean you need to spin around on that joker <laughs> and um he turned around and just walked off stage and he basically no he didn't no, he told stage. no he told him to play that song he said play the song and my sons are going to perform this yeah. song and we're going to give cookie her just do credit yeah. for the song that she wrote so i said mm -hmm. I, I just don't know i'm like is he bad is he partially bad you know. So then when they get him in the back, Cookie said, you did good, Lucius. Lucius, he said, I told you, you were in there. He said, it's all fake. He it's said, we rehearsed it last night. But I don't remember a God doing thing. It's like, take Dang. me home. Man, he I said, Claudia, Claudia take, take me home. home. Cookie looked at her. Now the whole time that Cookie and yeah. Lucius are sitting beside each other, Claudia in the background, straight Mm -hmm. I said somebody kick her tail. Now this is the part that bucked me up right here. When Cookie came out there on that porch and they were sitting down there on a little on a little um, yeah stoop out there, and he said, "Give me a kiss." Give me a kiss. Can I kiss and, you? And so um they didn't actually show them kissing, but I'm pretty sure he got a kiss. But uh Cookie confronted her about it, said, "You need to get your way up out of here. You need to leave about here." And she gonna tell her that this is a part of the program that. His feelings gonna slowly come back, and he's always gonna refer to something that's real. So he might use those emotions towards me until he can figure out how to redirect them towards, I guess y'all. I said bullshit because most people that come out of comas, they do kind of remember the person that they was messing with sometimes. Sometime. But they usually don't make up a whole nother. Whole nother life. Right. Unless. Unless they're being programmed, programmed. to do so. What Claudia is doing. Programming, I said. Yeah. Now this is an area of expertise that I know. My mama had a coma. Was in a coma. She had a brain aneurysm. Yep. And she didn't know me for what? About a month? Yeah. But when she clicked in. She ain't had no directed love. Well, don't you over that. Well, we need Lucia to click in. We gonna we gonna get him to click in. I'm gonna yeah. get her. I'm gonna get him her therapist. Cause this woman right here, she doing some unconventional bullshit. Yeah. Then I don't like it. I don't like it either. But she, Lucia told Cookie, said I don't remember nothing. She turned around and looked at Lucia's and um Claudia and said, 
oh baby, you will remember me. She said, I'm, I'm cooking, cooking lion, lion, baby. And walked, and walked off. I said, I said, I know that's right. Hell yeah. And it went off from there. Y'all tell me in the comments what the hell y'all. Oh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I always yeah. tell y'all forget to do that. Yeah, yeah. Because uh, uh, YouTube be tripping. Yeah, y'all let yeah y'all let us know what you what you think because I was y'all was y'all prepared for real? Like I just won't. think about it in hindsight. Just really think about this. Lucius ain't gonna have no leg forever. It, it, and from season three to season four right now, it's it's a whole different person. It's it like is. it's like watching Empire and then turn around watching Tyler Brown. Man, we gotta get Lucius back. We need him back. I need to start a hashtag. Bring Lucius back. Yeah, hashtag. Mama, they had one going when, when he was in jail. Free Lucius. <laughs> free Lucius. Free him this night. Yeah, free, free Lucius. Lucius. Oh, my God. And then when he, then when he come back, we're going to be like, somebody get him the hell up out of here. And, of course, we still got Andre and uh, that whole Sean thing still going on in the background. We're going to talk, talk about that this time because we're going to talk about it when it really starts coming up. Yeah, it all up. pans out. But they, they scared. And Sean's scared, too, because this happened in Vegas and Vegas police are involved because they want to know who, who did who, it. Who, who tried to blow him up. Yep. So he tried, he tried to prep Becky and uh, poke at Becky trying to get some information on flirt with and everything. Becky ain't fall for it. She said, you can't have no drinks with me, but you can watch the view as I walk away. I so said, good now, Becky. Becky look good. Portia look good, too. Mm -hmm. And Tiana, I don't remember if she had these, but they she there got this, them now. They there this season for sure. If she didn't have my number pen on mine, but straight from the VA. The dirty, dirty south. Sweat, sweet song. Holla. Holla.